obviously very happy uh, that we've uh, we've held the fire better than expected. Again, the credit goes to the wildfire firefighters out there, the structural firefighters, the first responders, uh, all the help from the RCMP. Uh, and I don't want to forget all the people that logistically support these operations. It's huge. It's tremendous. So obviously, I'm very happy about that. Um, and, and we hope to see continued success over the next few days and have good news in terms of how we continue to make progress when the cooler weather. For us, this is uh, great firefighting weather. We can really get in there and uh, really get a handle on this fire and, and, and really get a gr death grip on it. But for the wildfire stuff out in the forested area, that's going to take us a long time to clean up. But I feel very uh, uh, buoyed and happy that we're making great progress, uh, especially in the community, especially that we can get first responders there located back in the community, continuing to mop up hot spots and, and make it safe for as uh, safe as soon as we can. So is a turning point in these last 24 hours? Uh, it's uh, it definitely is a positive point for us, for sure. Yeah.